Hello, welcome back to another video. Slightly different video today. I thought I'd do a review on my Steel BG86C. So I've had this blower for about, I think, two or three years now. Um, never had any problems with it at all. None whatsoever. Goes from cold between one and two pulls, depending on how much you prime it and how warm it is outside. Every single time it goes within the second pull, I'd say. So it's incredibly reliable. When it's warm, it will go first pull every single time. So that's good. Um, so I'll run you through some of the features it's got first. So it's got cruise control, which is good if you're doing large, you know, driveways, for example. Um, stop button is just push it down and it auto returns. So you haven't got to faff around with, you know, trying to crank it over and then finding out that you've left it on off, for example. Um, nice big throttle, nice and easy to use, nice and comfortable as well to use as well. Uh, it's the C, so it's got aggro start, so it's super, super easy to start, it's ridiculously easy to start. It has an auto return choke as well, so put it on choke, prime it, and then when it runs, just flick it and it will automatically put it onto run, so it's super, super easy to start. It can literally take probably 20 seconds to start it, and then Within a minute, you've got it. You know, you can go full power. So it's brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Um, the base as well is all suspended. It's got quite a bit of wiggle in the base, which is good. So obviously, when you put it on the floor, it's not sort of vibrating its way miles down someone's driveway. It sits quite nicely where you want it to, which is good. Um, air filter housing, super easy. You just twist it off. So the servicing as well is super easy. It literally takes five minutes just to do a service, which I've done. New air filter as well. So it's super, super quick and easy to service these steel bits of kit. Nice big fuel, fuel tank as well. Fuel tank these will last you a while. A decent sized fuel tank here so super easy to fill up especially if you've got I've got the quick fill nozzle on the steel petrol can so it makes it so quick and easy to fill up uh, it's got the round tube on there at the moment which is for if you're working on grass or uneven terrain and you need a bit more or if you need a bit more power then that will funnel it nicely and give you a bit more power but it also comes with this flatter nozzle, which is for working on level terrain, driveways, example. <coughs> it does a good job with that. Um, the intake for the air is on the right hand side, so if you're left handed, that will suck your trousers in, which is a bit, a bit annoying. But I've had ones before where the intake is actually on the left hand side, and I'm right handed, so it would always be sucking me up, which is a big pain. This one, because I'm right-handed, the engine's here, so it's much better to use for right-handed people. Um, rubber on the handle makes it super comfortable as well. The handle as well has got a little bit of flex in it as well, some springs, so that, that helps with the vibration as well, which is good. Um, it's got a handle here as well. Sometimes it's quite useful actually just to sort of to get it at the sort of angle you want. Just it's a handy thing to have. Also you can get a vacuum that goes on here, a tube that goes on here, and a bag that goes on here, so you can suck up leaves with it. Which is quite a good idea. Um, yeah, so I'll run you through the technical specs now of it. So it is 27.2 cc engine so it's got quite a bit of kick to it it is surprisingly powerful um, blowing force with 15 newtons airspeed 89 meters per second 
vibration level is 1.9 meters per second squared, so it's not vibration is not that bad on it at all. Two-year domestic warranty, one-year commercial warranty, and it weighs 4.4 kilograms. So it does. It's not the lightest blower in the world. And after using it for you know an hour on bigger properties, you do you can feel the weight definitely. So, but it's it's one of those things that's so handy to have just to quickly you know tidy up little bits and pieces here and there because it especially as it goes first pull it's just so reliable it's 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 just a brilliant bit of kit really um, and like I've said I've had it two years now and had absolutely no problems with it whatsoever so it's it's the most reliable blower I've ever run in my life uh, along with one of the most powerful as well and actually I think when I compared this to my mate he's got a McCulloch backpack leaf blower which is I think 42cc engine this actually kicked out more airspeed at the end of the tip so this essentially had doesn't have more power but it has more uh, airspeed out the end of the tip so it essentially blows more or well, you notice that it blows more if that makes sense um, so the price of these if you're to buy one of these brand new on FR Jones and Son they are I think 238 I think so about 240 quid uh, I paid 270 for mine from a, a dealer, but recommended retail price from a dealer I think is 330. So they're not the cheapest blowers either. But I'd say if you're gonna get a blower, just go and spend the money. It's well worth the money. It it will pay for itself, you know, within probably a month. It's that good. It's an incredible bit of kit. Um, not much else to say really. Just overall brilliant blower. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll be putting some more ones out as well, some other machines I've got as well, so stay tuned. And uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next video.